Hi, Lisa. Good to see you again. How are you? Good. And you? How was your flight? It was good. It was so short, so I'm excited to be here. Perfect. Welcome to Frankfurt. I flew in this morning with Lufthansa straight from New York um, to Frankfurt. It only took about six and a half hours, which was so fast. Perfect. But what is the connection? What are the connections like to the United States? Frankfurt International Airport is one of the two hubs in Germany, and there are 247 weekly direct uh, connections from Frankfurt to 24 cities in North America. What makes it really easy for the delegates to get here and to get here very fast? Well, I'm excited to see more. Will we head into the city? Yeah, I will show you the way. <laughs> Great. How long is it going to take us from the airport to the city center? It will take us only 15 minutes. And um, from the main train station, it's just one more stop to the fairground. Today, the Messe Frankfurt is the world's largest trade fair, congress and event organizer with its own exhibition halls. They have 10 trade fair halls, the Congress Center, the Forum, the Festival Hall and the Cup Europa, which is popular for its green meetings. And another important fact is that you have 10,200 rooms just within walking distance from the facilities of the Messe Frankfurt. We're here in the city centre now. Tell us about the euro symbol. Frankfurt is a financial city and the idea of a common uh, European currency was born here, directly at the European Central Bank. The new European Central Bank just moved three years ago directly to the uh, riverside and I will show you where it is. Awesome! <laughs> This is the Römerberg, our town hall. In former times, all the congresses were held here. But now we go to the mine, to the river, and I will show you something over there. Great. Here, for example, you see the new European Central Bank, a really nice, cool high-rise at the um, East End district of Frankfurt. And here at the river, you have a lot of incentive options. You can have a lovely dinner um, in the evening on a cruise over there, for example, with a perfect skyline view. Or you can have a traditional uh, dinner in an apple wine restaurant on the other side of the river. There you will find all the museums in Frankfurt as well. So we're here now at the House and Dome, which translates to the House of the Cathedral. And the cathedral is just here to the right. I know lots of kings and emperors were crowned there. Um, here on this terrace, I know we can have lots of meetings and dinners and receptions, and there are meeting spaces downstairs mm -hmm. as well. But the very coolest thing, I think, is that it overlooks the new city as well as the new old town, which was rebuilt. Tell me a little bit about that. It was now rebuilt to the original footprints of the old town, how it um, was in the past. So um, in former times, everything was here. The commercial, the social life, the markets, the fairs were held here. The uh, kings were elected here as well. So now we are glad that we have this part of Frankfurt's history back. I think it's a beautiful contrast here with the old buildings, with the skyscrapers and just love it. Yeah. <laughs> So we're here in the Evangelische Akademie, which translates to the um, Protestant Academy. This is a really cool venue. Yeah, especially here you can see the contrast of Frankfurt. It's the new and the old, and in this room you can see it perfectly. I know Frankfurt and the fairgrounds and the Congress is known for having these large-scale meetings. What is one of the meetings that's coming through? So in 2020, for example, we'll have the Euler Congress, which is the annual congress of rheumatology. And uh, it is one of the biggest here. So there will be 15,000 delegates here in Frankfurt, and we are looking forward to welcoming them here. We. Um at the German Convention Bureau actually wrote about one of the events that happened in Frankfurt last year, the Me Convention. Can you tell mm -hmm. us a little bit about that? Yes, it was a collaboration between Mercedes-Benz and South by Southwest and their goal was it to, um, to create something unique. There were global leaders and pioneers. The convention was so successful that they decided to have it all over the world now. Thank you so much for such an informative, fun day here in Frankfurt. 
I'm sure that the North American Meeting Planner and the International Meeting Planner will be able to find the perfect location here in Frankfurt and when they're ready, they should reach out to you and reach out to me. And I think now we have it's time to... Yeah. <laughs> Cheers.